Hi guys, it is the end of a long, kind of tiring week. I have not been feeling the best, so I just got the best surprise. That just is helping me feel better, but I wanted to come and show you guys before my kids tore into it. It is the first package we have ever received from our YouTube channel. And it is from Australia. How amazing is that? Oh, this chair keeps moving. Guys, I'm telling you, I'm struggling. This just like made my day. So I had the kids and some cousins here today and I didn't really feel like doing much, but they were dead set on doing something. So we finally came up with bowling here in Eagle River, so I wouldn't have to drive very far because we did the zoo yesterday, we did the sand dunes the day before, like they have not been hurting for activities, but they needed something today. So I decided on bowling. Well, I got in the car and there was a packing slip that I remember we picked up from the mailbox yesterday. And I didn't even look at it because I was tired when we came home and I just left it in the car knowing that the next time I got in the car we would go to the post office. Well, I took a look at it and our postman has the worst handwriting ever and I thought it said Australia. And my YouTube friend, Vanessa in Australia, had said she was gonna send the boys a package, which is like so sweet and so amazing. So I had given her our address a couple weeks ago and anyways, so I thought that this packing slip said Australia and so then I was like, oh, we're going on the way to bowling. We are going to go pick up this package. Well, I go to the post office, I wait in a very long line, you know, I've got crazy kids and then all of a sudden I get up there and they hand me a fishing pole package, Bass Pro Shop, but she'd already taken the slip and I was like, hmm, that's not what I expected. But took the kids bowling and on the way home I just kept thinking about it. I was like, I don't think they gave me the right package. I think I had two packages and there's gonna be a slip in my mailbox today when I get back. So we pull up to the mailbox and sure enough, there is a slip in my box that says Bass Pro Shop, which was the fishing pole that I picked up, which meant I was not crazy and I had seen Australia written on the packing slip. So I called Mark really quick and luckily it was 5.20, he was in Eagle River where the post office was and he said, oh I'll stop by and see. It closes at 5.30 but he was close enough that he could make it because I wouldn't have made it in time. So there was, there was this amazing huge package, Vanessa. Thank you so much. She was the first person on this YouTube channel that commented on video after video after video that gave me hope that there would be people like you guys watching that would um, want to come back for more and more and um, invest your time in our family and we just really appreciate it. Now I started to open this box with my kids and I thought I gotta go film this even though I look terrible and you know tired and sick and everything but I wanted to go film it so that I could share some of them with you. Now, Vanessa was sweet and wrote the boys the sweetest card. Bennett just read it aloud to us all. And thank you so much. And then she wrote Mark and I the sweetest note. And we agree with you, Vanessa. We hope that our paths cross sometime, whether we are in Alaska or in Australia. That would be amazing. We would love to, to meet you and your family. So, I'm gonna change the camera so we can see this amazing box of goodness. Now, Vanessa found our channel because of a Costco haul, so the snacks are appropriate. Look how pretty this looks. The cards were on top. Oh, how fun. We've got some Carmelo Koalas. Wow. This box, you guys, is so heavy, and it's like full to the brim. You just like put it in there so perfectly. Freddo's milk chocolate. Snakes alive. You guys, this is just so cool. We're definitely gonna have to share these with the cousins that have been to Australia. Now these are called Shapes Pizza Flavored, Barbecue Flavored, Vegemite Flavored. We've got some Banjo Mint Cara Bears. Ooh, yum, I love anything mint. Uncle Toby's Fruit Roll Ups, yum. Cheese Twisters. Wagon wheels, with marshmallows, those are going to be a favorite. Tim Tams, I've heard about those but never had them. I heard they're really good with hot chocolate. Ooh, mint sliced cookies, flakes, Cadbury flakes, yum. 
Oh, we are gonna have some fun this weekend. Mark and Hunter are leaving on a hunting trip. We'll have to send them with some of these yummy treats. Um, biscuit cookies. Jumpy's chicken flavored crunchy potato snacks. Cherry ripe. You know what? My dad also lived in Australia for two years, so this is gonna be so fun to show him too. Cadbury, it looked like maybe peanut butter called Picnics. Wow, this just keeps going and going and going. Violet crumbles. Yum. Oh, these are going to be my favorite. I might have to um, hide these because I love licorice. Raspberry licorice. Milk chocolate licorice. Ooh, Mark loves black licorice, so. Wow. Thank you so much, Vanessa. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Go on the snack. As you can see, the boys had so much fun looking through the box and eating their way through it. This is mine! No, bro! <laughs> Next, it was Mark's turn. He came upstairs and had such a great time looking through the box and checking out all the goodies. This is that is a very fat oh, little kangaroo. Wow. <laughs> Everett, show the camera. Oh, Everett, what do you have? Oh my goodness, Everett. This is fat kangaroo. I got one too. Huh? Fat kangaroo. I've never heard the crumbliest yeah, milk I chocolate. Oh. Huh. Fat kangaroo. I like it. I like it. Well, we ate and ate till we could eat no more and put it away for later. Mark and Hunter did pull out several things to take on their caribou hunt with them, and they said it tasted so good after a successful hunt. We then were able to share some with my dad who lived in Australia in the 1960s and my brother-in-law Scott who grew up in Australia and it was just a good trip down memory lane for them. This box was pure joy. Thank you so much to Vanessa and Sarah for your continued kindness to our family. We are grateful for each of you that are watching and we will see you again soon.